saw the junk he was selling was bad, and he panics and he's setting you up to back him. That's what he's doing, okay? Take the cuffs off. You should check this dude out, okay? Because he's playing you. I know, Larry. He was having problems with his meds. Well, you don't know this guy, do you? You know this guy? You don't know this guy. This guy's trouble. Maybe, but he's my trouble. So take the cuffs off, and I'll handle the rest. Fine. Fancy meeting you here. Hey. Uh, 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 listen, I just thought you should know that Larry's autopsy showed no signs of illegal drugs, so you're in the clear. Great. Thanks a lot. What are you doing here? What? You don't think I like this music? No, of course not. No, I mean, that's that's not why I'm surprised. It's just unusual. It's unusual for me to, to see anybody... To see Hans at the opera? No, to see anybody from work. I mean, I won my tickets on the opera box. Congratulations. Hey, Henri. You check your attitude. You give people a little room if you want to make it in the real world. People like Wilson? Give them room to screw me? No, I mean you learn to tell the difference between bullshit and the real thing. Like you did with Larry. Enjoy the opera. Excuse me. Can I see these earrings, please? I'll be with you in a minute. The diamond studs. Excuse me. Miss? Would you mind trying this on? So I can see how they look? I can do that, sir. Thanks. She looks more like my girlfriend. Of course. Nice skin. Thank you. Oh, yeah. These are beautiful. You smell great. Okay, that's enough. Let me just, wow. Okay, no, I just want to. Okay, just, just, okay. Wait, just let me. All right, stop. Let go Sir, of me. Please. Are you all right? <laughs> hey, Brule. Brule. You make contact? Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be hot. Yeah, she went for you? Don't worry about the chick, all right? No, no, you're the man. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm the man. But maybe you've been inside too long, huh? You got that piece? Alfonso's waiting. You got a message for me? If I do, I'll run him a postcard. Your boy is here to see you.
What's up? I'm the one who usually pays the surprise visits. Yeah, I know. Seems like every time I run into you, I blow my fuse. That's all right. You're mellow out. You just need a little time on the outside. Can I buy you a cup of coffee? Save your money. I accept your apology. Look, I got something that I'd like to ask you. I've been doing a lot of thinking, mm -hmm. and I've decided that... What's on your I... mind, Henri? Well, like you said, we're going to be working together. Mm -hmm. I thought maybe I should tell you about myself. My life story. Your life story? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, the best part isn't in my file. <laughs> Well, now, that is something that I do need to know, but I have probably an hour left on this desk, so next visit will work out just fine. It's kind of important. Fine. All right, Junction Cafe, one hour. Great. So what do you want? Well, if you really want to know, he was about to lodge a complaint against you for the Larry Frank incident. And I suppose you enlightened him that uh, he's the convict and we're the guardian angels? I told him to go ahead. Well, you want to get accusatory here? Why are you letting this guy work you? You are so into yourself. He didn't even mention it. You think you're Miss Untouchable, huh? You think you're in control? You know as well as I do, the minute you trust these guys are gonna screw you. When this guy does it to you, don't be surprised, no backup on your side. Great, I'll probably be safer that way. I grew up on the street, you know, around a lot of hookers and dancers. They liked me. I looked out for them. I think you're probably the first girl I ever had coffee with that wasn't a dancer. Woman. First woman, and I don't believe you. Woman. That's true. Look, I could never really... Let me see. I could never really talk to nice girls, women. All right. What is this about? I want you to teach me. Teach you what? I want you to teach me how to be with a nice woman. Educated. Classy. I help out with things. You know, I do. But with practical things. Like how to drive. You know, you were right about the other night. I never went to an opera before. Well, is there someone special to you that likes opera? Now, you don't understand it. I don't want to scare people. I just want to be normal. Okay, well, um, how did you like the opera? Strange. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like a weird dream. All those people singing at the same time, you know, their, their voices were like so big, it was almost like they could fly. 